Okay, so what we have here is the um, the Arduino with the lithium battery pack and the touch shield slide. And what we're going to be looking at here today is the new firmware for this. Um, so let's go ahead and turn this on. You'll see the boot screen come up real quick. Now, first thing is the um, human machine interface. So this acts kind of like a mouse here. It allows you to tap, kind of like you'd get with a PDA. But in addition to that, uh, like a keyboard, it supports tap and hold. So when you do that, you'll get three signals, a tap, a tap and hold, and then a repeat. Now if you just move it around, you won't get the hold. If you tap, hold, and then move, it keeps the signal. This new firmware also has anti-aliasing support, um, so we'll show you both ways. First, here's normal quality, normal quality filled, and then here is the anti-aliased, and the anti-aliased filled. Same thing again with the quad, normal, normal filled, anti-aliased, anti-alias filled. And there's actually two different kinds of anti-alias. There's quick and then there's high quality. Quick will just use the four color and the back color. Um, high quality will actually check the pixel behind you so that you get proper anti-aliasing if there's a graphic or something behind there. Um, rectangles completely unaffected because it's just straight lines. Um, here's an ellipse filled, anti-alias ellipse, anti-alias ellipse filled, and again plain. And there we have the latest firmware.